Hello there, and welcome to another one of our Lexical Lab One Minute English videos. If you enjoy this video, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel if you're not subscribed already. And do check out our website www.lexicallab.com to find out about the other courses we offer there. Unless you've been living under a rock recently, you've almost certainly heard or read about the leaking of the so-called Pandora Papers. This is the name that's being given to over 11 million documents that have found their way into the public arena, thanks to the work of crusading journalists. And these papers basically document the way in which the super-rich of the world have been using fair means and foul to hide their money, to wash their dirty money, and to buy influence with governments around the world. Our government here in the UK has been caught with egg on its face. It's been caught in an embarrassing situation because the government has clearly been taking money from foreign donors without declaring it, and it's been breaking all kinds of financial regulations relating to who political parties can and can't accept money from. Now, of course, the government refuses to accept any responsibility in all of this and have been strenuously denying any criminal wrongdoing. If you talk about wrongdoing, it's a kind of journalistic or news-related word, meaning bad or illegal behaviour. So often politicians might be accused of wrongdoing. They might strenuously deny any wrongdoing. Uh, the police might promise to open investigations if new evidence of wrongdoing emerges. Uh, politicians might just try to pass the buck, refuse to accept responsibility, and say they were unaware of any wrongdoing going on beneath them in their departments or in their government. And very occasionally, very, very, very occasionally, they might even admit to wrongdoing. If you've enjoyed this video, make sure you click the like button, the thumbs up sign. It helps us with the algorithm. Please do share it with friends, students, colleagues, anyone else you think might be interested. And in the comment section below, we'd love to hear any stories of wrongdoing from where you are. 